Ladies and gentlemen, look who's back on the program. It's John Travolta. John! I am. I'm Disco Dave. <laughs> uh, nice to have you with us. You know, you look different than I remember you last time. Last time, a couple of years ago, you look. You have a different look to you. Fat look, you mean? I, no, you don't look. But you're you're bigger than I remember I, I, you being. I'm a bigger guy than I was a few years ago, yeah. Dave. And, and is there a purpose for that? Uh, yes, I'm, I'm I'm bulking up for my next part. Oh, yes. what, and what is that? Uh, Clowny the fat man. <laughs> Well, it, it certainly sounds like a plum roll, John. You're, you're lucky to no, be able no, to snare actually, that. No, I do. I have a problem with fans more than I have with my, myself. I don't, I don't actually mind being heavier. Uh -huh. you know? So you are a little heavier then? Oh, about um, 30 pounds heavier. Wow. What, what weight did, you, did we last see you at? Uh, 190. Uh-huh. So now you I'm weigh about 215. Yeah. Something like that. And, uh, but you don't feel uh, sluggish? You don't feel like no, you want to lose No, I feel good. I, I feel... <laughs> I, I don't know what that means. You don't feel... <laughs> No, um, uh, no, actually, I feel pretty good. I mean, you know, having a baby uh, ad adds to this concept. <laughs> John, 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 you're you're confused. No, uh, my, my wife got my wife got got uh, pregnant and uh, gained some weight, and I gained weight with her. Uh huh. And yeah. and how does that happen? Did you did you alter your diet? Did you just uh? You what? just tend to eat with your wife maybe twice as much as she uh, uh -huh. eats. You know? <laughs> now, they say when a woman is pregnant, she gains what? Between 20 and 40 pounds? Is that Probably what they say? Probably something like yeah. that. And, and your wife gained the weight during the pregnancy? I gained the weight for her. Yeah. And, and then, then she probably lost the weight. Now, are you going to lose your weight or not? Well, I hope so, you know. I'll, I'll, I'll lose some weight. Yeah. How do you, I, I, you know, I, I, I attempted to make it vogue. You know, I told friends of mine, you know, it's a, a moral code... Uh, a private moral code between actors to keep yourselves in shape and you know <laughs> thing but i encouraged uh, actors to gain weight <laughs> and has it worked uh, well i i told uh, i told bruce willis i said you know the weight looks good on you man <laughs> i'm not kidding it's, it's the trend you know 40 to 60 pounds well, it's it's a leading men trend you know? <laughs> yeah. so, so william conrad will be busier than yes, ever yeah. uh, he's the icon yeah so, so tell us a little bit about the baby. The baby is now uh, he's brand a month new, old. a month old, still brand yes. new. Yeah, and uh, he's backstage. And if you want to meet him, you can. All right. Well, <laughs> wouldn't it be awful through some kind of mix-up that baby ends up going to Bermuda? <laughs> it's happened before. <laughs> when has it happened before? Uh, and well, tell us a little bit about the experience, and then we'll, we'll bring your son out here. Well, it was, um, I learned some new words, like yikes. Mm -hmm. You know, I was a nervous father, so I couldn't grab for any particular vocabulary, so new words came up in my mind, like, yikes! You know, and, uh, <laughs> you know your, uh, your son is a beautiful baby boy, yikes! And the doctor finally said, would you please stop saying yikes? <laughs> it's making us all nauseous. <laughs> I, I can understand that, yeah. Uh, so, and, and, and fathering now, what is life like at home? Now, of course, you probably have a staff working around the clock for well, you. Well, I, I take the night shift, mm -hmm. and uh, the nurse takes the morning shift, and my wife has the rest of the day to tend to the baby. Mm -hmm. is, is your wife here with the child? Yes, of course, uh, Kelly is here. And All right. she, uh, now, do you, do you want to you bring baby out? Uh, do I'd you want us to. to go look at baby? How do you want to do this? No, if he's, in, if he's you know, doing okay, then I'd love to bring him. We'll do the baby right now, yeah. And, and what, is, uh, what is your son's name? His name is Jet, J-E-T-T. -T. Oh, Jet. Now, is that because of your love of flying? Yes, primarily. Yeah. And there are some characters in the past named Jet in books and movies. But yeah. Primarily my, my love of flying. Right. Where he is, Paul, maybe a little uh, baby introductory music if you have something over there for us. This is uh, John Travolta, and, and his, uh, this is your wife here, right? Yes, Kelly Preston. Oh, look at baby. Hi. Well, watch your step. Wow! Wow! There, look at that. Here, have a seat there. Wow, that's a beautiful boy. Thank you. Yikes! Yikes! <laughs> well, my goodness, you must be very, very excited. Ah, oh, he's wonderful. Yeah, and and is he? Uh, we got him awake. We got him asleep. And well, he's awake with the hiccups. Yeah. He already talks. Sounds like Wendell. <laughs> Oh, that's a that's He's a beautiful. Dressed in the uh, baseball outfit, and you're got a little Mets uniform on there. Yeah. Well, actually, it's just a generic. Uh, yeah. It's a red. There. 
Very, yes, right, yeah. very, very sweet baby. All right, let's, uh, what do we do here? We'll do a uh, commercial and then we'll uh, be right back, kids. That's a beautiful kid. Thanks. Beautiful baby. And your wife is lovely as well. I have never seen your wife, never met your wife. Yeah, she is. She's terrific. Yeah. What's her name? Did we get her name? Kelly Preston. Kelly, okay. But now, the, the hair that the uh, baby has, is, is th th that'll go away, right? And then is replaced later? I guess. I don't, I'm not sure, really. <laughs> well, no. Isn't, isn't that just baby hair, and then later they get their regular Apparently hair? Apparently so. It, it's like teeth, and they'll get some teeth, and then they'll, I understand those come out, and then they get more teeth. <laughs> Babies, in a manner of speaking, are just hair and teeth machines. Kind of, yeah. Uh, well, geez, that's very exciting. Everything else just uh, really doesn't matter when you have a beautiful little baby like that in your life, does yeah, it? Or so it seems. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, are you still flying a lot? Still fly a lot, mm -hmm. as much as I can. I got oh. another jet rating recently, another type rating. All right, let's go back. Let's, let's uh, talk a little bit about your history of aviation. When did you first take up flying? When, when was your first when lesson? When I was 16 at Teterboro, New Jersey. 16 because you, just a, a love you had? Passion, or? love uh -huh. for it. And then uh, I proceeded to uh, uh, take up it more seriously, and uh, I got five different jet ratings. Now that's a lot of work, isn't it? Yeah. Now, how many hours do you have? Uh, About three thousand. Three thousand, and most that's, of it's jet. So you could now actually qualify for a commercial pilot's oh, sure. license. Beyond, yeah, beyond that. Yeah, sure. and and the plane you have now is like a, a big. Uh, it's a, called a G two. It's a it's a rather large corporate jet. Right. Yeah. And how many does it seat? Uh, Fourteen. And how many engines? Two. Uh, how many horsepower at the shaft? <laughs> I heard a pilot That's say that once. I don't know what that means. Of really? Thrust. Uh, a big, powerful, fast plane? It's probably a little overpowered for its size, but uh, that's okay. I don't mind that. Uh, it's the, the overpower is it can get you out of trouble. Is that the theory? I think so, yeah. Or just for doing stunts on the runway. <laughs> <laughs> a little bold, yeah. yeah. Uh, and, and what do you do with the plane? What do you do with this uh, I mostly skill? take it from A to B, you know, 50% of its business and 50% of its pleasure. And uh -huh. I flew it here. You, you flew, you and your family from yes, where? from, uh, we were in Maine, uh -huh. but I uh, flew into Teterboro, and uh, the, the holding pattern was longer than the flight itself, actually. Now, why would there be a holding pattern over in New Jersey? Just traffic, you know. They need to general travel. aviation traffic? Yeah, general aviation yeah. traffic. And so when you leave here, will you and the family get in the plane and go somewhere else? Uh, California. Tonight. Wow. So this is for you just like uh, having a, a car, except that it's an airplane. Wow. How about that for insight? Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very much. Yes, sir. Dr. IQ does it again. Yikes. <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> uh, you have a film, another, another a couple of movies well, you want to I, mention. I was telling you that I am bulking up. I, I'm <laughs> it's just an excuse. Now, I am, uh, I'm going to do Bimbo, the, uh, the spoof movie of Rambo. Now, is this for real or is this another joke? No, this joke? is real. No, it's yeah. not a joke. And uh, the trainer, a personal trainer, said that I could actually turn this fat into muscle. <laughs> <laughs> and it would it would benefit me in the in the role. So you know I haven't lost any time. Yeah. You know it's a, right. I can think of it as off season bulking up. And and then there's going to be an, uh, another look who's talking. Look who's talking three. Look in who's the talking fall. three. All right, good for you. And and the baby. So who cares about anything else? Yeah, you yeah. Good to see you, John. Thank good you very much you. for being here, John Travolta, ladies and gentlemen. Well,